Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming to the channel. And let's get into my last story of this magazine that I got that has Margaret, um, Meghan Markle on it. We're going to be talking about Matthew Perry's, uh, the cast from, uh, cast member from Friends. Um, it goes on to say, Matthew Perry's a hotel hermit. Lord, he don't went from sugar to shit. He looks so disheveled. Uh, you can barely recognize the man. All right. If you didn't know who he was and they didn't say Matthew Perry slash Friends sitcom show. Okay. Let's go on into it. It says Fallen Friends star lives in pricey room, but only leaves for the hospital or to make hospital visits. In a staggering reversal of fortune, once high-flying friends hunk Matthew Perry is now a pathetic loner who bounces between hospital beds and a hotel room. That's the tragic revelation of a national inquiry investigation that's learned the fallen star only regular companions or bartenders at the Big Apple Cash, I mean Crash Pad, where he lived for months. Sources said Matthew, who turns 50 on August 19th, happy belated birthday, Matthew, has been staying in a 7,000 a night penthouse after surgery last year. For a gastrointestinal perforation. Left him hospitalized for months. Although Matthew has been to rehab three times. One bartender claims the actor is still hitting the bottle. Okay. He doesn't like to be disturbed. And would go into private areas of the hotel. Where only VIPs are allowed. He'll order a few drinks. Strong drinks. The source said, hardly anybody recognizes him because he's such a mess compared to what people remember. He kept to himself and would hardly leave his room until after dark, except for a cigarette or a hospital appointment. An insider added, he was mostly holed up in his room. When I saw him, he seemed out of it and sickly. Another source squealed, he's been living here so long that he brought or he bought his own supersized TV for the room. Now, where they do the app? If he's staying at a, a hotel, how you want? Well, he's Matthew Perry. And it seems like he's spending his fortune he made on Friends and other adventures he was a part of. He's going into a hotel room that's $7,000 a night. But yeah, he looks like this. Mm. He looks like a homeless bum with breasts. Don't he, y'all? Oh, my goodness. Oh, but anyway, um... The Inquirer recently published photos of the bloated and dishevel uh, disheveled star. He's been spotted smoking cigarettes and guzzling diet soda before checking into New York University Lagon Hospital. The actor, who did not respond to a request for comment, earned $1 million per episode on the hit sitcom in 2002, but he was recently snubbed by his own screen wife, Courtney Cox. Courtney has been here um, while Matthew is mopping around, or moping him around, I'm sorry. But I've never seen her acknowledge him or say hello, the snitch revealed. It's always a snitch in your circle. Uh huh. It's probably sold the, um, that's the story too, Inquirer. All right. As the Inquirer has reported, Matthew shamelessly chased Courtney lookalikes. On dating apps, but insiders said he barely socialized in months, except for random women who were put off by his grubby fingernails and ratty clothes. Ratty clothes. Matt would be with the same young blonde, but on three occasions there were different women on his arm, the source said. He would leave with the girls and go through a door into a private area. His downfall has sparked concerns among pals. Matt needs help, a mole said. That's a snitch. Um, we hope he's getting it, or he won't be around much longer. So see, they calm this brother out too. He was riding high at one time. You know, getting the best roles, getting paid a lot of money for the sitcom show. Um uh, I mean some cast members probably getting paid a thousand. I mean not a thousand, but thousands. A dollar's why he was getting paid a million. Of course, he was basically uh, the one people liked. 
of course, on the show. And usually if you're doing your part and you're getting very good ratings and people are talking about you, be it negative or positive, yep, you're going to have an opportunity for that particular season. And then when you go back trying to negotiate a nicer contract, it will be that win for you as well. <laughs> Only thing you got to do is play your part and play it up to oblivion in a sense. And they would give you just about everything you wanted or could ever dream of. But see, in his case, he made so much money and he's paying and staying somewhere that's not a house. Okay. He want all the amenities of living in a, I guess, hotel and have them cater to his every whim. But if he's trying to be in secluse, uh, that's not really working for him. Okay. Because people still spying on him, seeing him for who he is, and they're turning their backs because they don't want to be bothered with him no more. I tell you, what about your friends? Will they let you down? Will they stand their ground? A yay, yay. All right. But Courtney seems to come and frequent where he stays at very often, whether to have lunch or have a little drink or drink. But when he come around and she see him, she turn her head and get the hell out of there. Because I guess her image is a little bit more precious on who she conducts herself around in public to the one she don't want to be seen with in public. Now, ain't that call the kettle black? Oh, anyway, that's all I had of this story. Uh, Mr. Matthew Paris, hopefully, with a lot of prayers and discernment, maybe he can be turned around. But... I guess that's how the industry do you. I guess he ain't uh, getting no parts and no plays, no other TV shows. That may be coming out. I don't know. Maybe they're just overlooking him. Maybe he's depressed, honey. But I understand why he's an actress, A-list actor at that. Uh, and he don't have regular insurance where he can go to the hospital. I mean, go to the regular position office. He has to make appointments and strictly be seen in the hospital all the time. Is that what these celebrities do? They don't meet with their own doctor? They can just go to the hospital and check themselves in? He stayed out for six months and he come back and stay at the hotel for six months? Matthew. But if you got the money to spend it. Mm. I, don't, I don't know it well. I don't know no superstars. Ooh, I've met some celebrity reality stars here in Atlanta, but I guess if, if you don't really want to care or you feel like you're doing well and, and other people see differently, I guess we all have different perspectives. But for him to be very seclusive in a hotel, uh, meeting women, bringing them back, and then he goes through a separate door. What is he doing? What is he doing? But that's all I have for this video. Hope you all enjoyed it. Get in them comments. Talk to me about it. Maybe I missed something. I don't know. I just don't understand why, you know, his friends don't want to be his friends. They were close when they were making money together. Now that he's not and friends is canceled and in, uh, what do you call it, when it's uh, being recycled on other stations, residual type money coming in. Mm. I tell you, no friends. They let you down over time. I meant to say they let you down all the time, but I'm just getting sleepy. That's what y'all hear. When it doesn't be any talking, it should be some talking. I'm yawning. <laughs> so let me get off this story. Let me get off this computer and go relax my mind. Have a blessed day or a blessed evening, I should say. And I'll see you next time uh, for a video. Bye-bye.